What's up YouTube and welcome to the first video to the new titanium challenge. By the way, many people, not many, but some people obviously pointed out that it was 1st of April and they thought like, mm, is he maybe doing April's Fools with us? No, I'm not. I can guarantee you that is coming straight, straight from Hutch. So you still have a chance to win your titanium package basically and um, if you have no idea what I'm talking about you should check out yesterday's video for sure but all right I told you I want to um, drop those videos as soon as possible and I will keep doing that um, here we have the first titanium challenge everybody gets one formula fun and actually yeah you see everybody gets one the Jaguar XK 150 um, you need five of those you need to collect five of those within the next two weeks don't sell them. I cannot stress that out more. Don't sell them. You will need them to get the next car for free. So, and then you have a chance of the titanium pack, which then gives you a guaranteed epic ride and even a 25% chance of a legendary. But all right, let's go into it. Italian Renaissance 3 Great Exhibition 2. It's, uh, it's, it's an interesting one. And I actually was doing some research here. You see currently, this is what my deck looks like. So, I have the D24 Pinion Farina. We got the Mirror Roadster. We have not a maxed out Vauxhall Adam Vox S. I will work on that. I got a Lotus 7. And the Maserati Ghibli SS Spider. I'm not really super happy with my deck. For example, um, I know there will be some... Um, some more twisty turns and for that actually having one of those uh abats would be great which i was working on but got rid on rid of and that's nah, sucks a little bit but all right let's give it a try now okay so i can beat him on half mile oh, this is already the tough one man he's uh, it's going to be interesting so on half mile here we have Happen Road, that is a loss. On half mile is a win. <sighs> on Twisty Road, hopefully a win. That's what I'm counting on. And then we got Happen Road and... Oh, Twisty Road. It's going to hurt. <laughs> so let's see. Oh, man. Uh, maybe I should... Because what I focus right now, this is like my Nemesis deck. Yeah, like the track set right now. This is really the bad one. Because what I'm focusing here is to get points on half mile and quarter mile. But you see, I did my 217. That's nice. Because he obviously was focusing on the twisty turns. So let's see if there will be enough. Whew. That's not even maxed out yet. All right, good. The Lotus 7 is definitely an RQ saver here. Absolutely. Okay, first two. But let's see. Let's see what else comes up. Quarter mile, half mile. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, this, is, this will be interesting. The Mura Roadster is an interesting one because this is like my one of my fastest rides regarding one mile. There will be a one mile track later. Here we can obviously beat this and we can beat this. We shouldn't worry. Then we go here like this. Twisty Road, we drop him. We obviously lose because it's four-wheel drive standardized. And again, we will lose on Twisty Circuit. Most likely. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I was looking like, oh, performance dice. Nah, nah. But you see, RQ Saver, we're losing here by 51 points, and that's absolutely okay. Then we go in here. Unfortunately, here we won't do many points. Yeah, we only win by 50 because he's dropping the Ghibli as a spider. But I hope that I can do some extra points here. 132. Ooh, that will be tight. So let's see. Those are the Abads I was talking about. As you can see, those are useful rides, and he's actually beating me. <sighs> ah, yeah, yeah, I need one of those abats again. Woo, and we did it again. It's a calculated loss thing here, yeah, absolutely. It's, it's not that easy, 
And you cannot win all rounds, but someone was just beating me. Ah, it's going back and forth. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay, Quartama. The Muir Roads that we can beat. Fast Circuit. Oh man, we, he goes for Slick Tires. Yeah, interesting. This is interesting. Um, So, that's a win. That's... Oh, he did a different setup there. Interesting. Good to know, because I do have a second Lotus 7. I can work on that. Whew, man, this is not easy. Uh, I'm not satisfied with my deck. I'm not satisfied. But I'm trying to give you here an overlook of what you can do. What you can do with it. Um, what should we do? What should we do? Should we go here fast, circuit, Or should we drop him on Twisty? Now we go here. And on fast, circuit, should we either drop? I think we go with the no, Mural Roadster. Hoping that. Oh man, they. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Hurry! Yes, okay, at least this guy I can beat. Uh, 57, yeah, well. I'm, I'm okay losing against higher IQ cars, that's fine. Losing against lower IQ cars, like here right now, that's not fine. <laughs> man, not bad. Maybe I should go away from having standard ties. Okay, good. That is the setup. Good, good, good. Just wanted to make sure. And the last one we win. Nothing beats the Pinion Farina there. But just to give you an outlook, yeah? So, where I'm lacking cars is, I mean, Italian Renaissance is... I'm good all the way up, but um, I'm not so good here. Like you see, my 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 handling is really like, I mean, the best handlings there I have is uh, for the Muir P400, which comes with performance tires, and then the next one is um, off-road tires. So that's a uh, 86 there and a 79. It's tough. It's it's not that easy. Absolutely not for me. But it's interesting. I like it. Um, and great exhibition-wise. Well, maybe I should do a switch. That I drop one of those babies here look at him i mean that can be very useful he is a happen uh happen road king obviously and then we still have some some tools here with the open manta 400 or the 400 rally i'm thinking yeah that i might go slower here so all i need to do is actually drop the ghibli as a spider that's what i need to do if i drop this one which is not that useful at the moment then I can go high on the others. Uh, let's see. But look at this. I'm like, ugh. That's like, that's why I'm. I could go with the Turbina. That gives me two more points, and two more points means I could. Well, like, well, why not just using this one? That's not too bad. That's already better. <laughs> that already looks better. I know we don't have to standardize, but we have this fast circuit track, which is tight. That is that is really tough to go with that, something like this. That looks way better, kinda. I'm still not satisfied with the Ghibli as a spider. If I could exchange the Ghibli as a spider for one of those Abad rides, I kinda feel like I have a good chance here. Okay, let's try. Oh, wow. Okay, this guy, interesting, interesting. That's that's one way as well. You could just go like boom on like two tracks and then you go really low on the other three. So this is what he did. Obviously, Filippo Lissoni, he goes monster here and absolutely here. That's fine, let's go for that. Okay, however, we drop him there. Our IQ saver, slalom test, great. Then on one mile drag, we drop him and on quarter mark, we drop him, and then we need to see. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Um, when I go G there will be. Uh, should we drop him here so that we're not losing by too many here? Yeah, let's do that. Oh no, it's Monaco G Force test. Wow, wait, wait, wait. Monaco G Force test is interesting because you do have this longer. Um, st where you can speed up like a longer straight. So I kind of want to see. What happens if I drop him here and him here? 
Let's go for it. That's going to be interesting. Okay, here we come home with how many points? 96. And uh, the next one we lose by, I say, 150. Oh, 75. Okay, so, so far we're on the plus. We're on the plus. That's good. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, my friend, my friend. <laughs> yeah, those Bentley rides, they they look they look so promising, so promising. Boom. Pininfarina coming home 61 points, nice. And here the Accu Saver. I think like one of the key cars is absolutely the Lotus 7. You need to have this car. It helps you so much. Oh, this is like the key car for me so so far so oh here again he goes all in with that one obviously we'll lose but then it's a, it's an interesting it's interesting let's see what else we have here okay okay there we go that's it good good quarter I like this what else we got here here lotus 7 smart guy so he goes more balanced i feel like <laughs> After the Lotus 7, he goes three times rare, and then he goes on quarter mile and drops this guy, the Mura S. Not bad. Then here is a, ah there those cars I mean, 595 Turismo, great 5683. Quarter mile, that's the Maserati Indy, yeah. Okay, okay, and here, yeah, you shouldn't forget that this car 2013 has traction control. So it helps a lot for cutting circuit. But there's a question, can I beat that? Can I? Can I not? Oh, he goes forward to drive standard tires. I didn't see that on fast circuit. Smart guy. Okay. However, I want to try the first one. I want to see if he can beat that. So here we go. Cutting circuit. This guy comes again. Then quarter mile. This guy. And then is the question what we do next. Uh, I think fast circuit here, fast circuit here, and yeah, drop on cutting circuit. And let's see how many points we lose by. Okay. I was looking at the GTA Stradale as well. Ah, oh, 69 points. I can live with that. Absolutely. I'm absolutely satisfied with that number. So 91. Yes. So we already got like, look at this, man. It is a lifesaver, the Lotus 7. You need to have this car. I feel like this, really, this is like the key car for the, for the tier two at least. I don't know for tier one, obviously, then next would be to, to drop this stupid um, Abad. I need that. Um, but beside that, the Lotus, the Lotus is really important. Lotus 7. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed today. We are going to do a giveaway on Instagram, so definitely check out my Instagram. I'm currently collecting ideas for that. And yeah, I will keep on uploading those videos early, which are related to all the titanium events. So besides that, I will keep uploading just normal. Wish you a pleasant day and bye-bye.